All right, so what we have is a uh, home job at building some steps and matching up to the existing. So this has been poured on top of some uh, older stuff. I'm going to try and match it up. So we're doing a bit of filling, pre-filling, building up. And we'll just try and make it look reasonably as good as the top section up there. So we'll start with pre-filling. So what we're doing here is building up the step riser down here and also the top of this plinth. So we've got a piece of timber to form a, a level edge and it's just a case of filling it up, leaving it set before we do any more. So building up the top surface so we get a reasonably straight line for a start and then it's just a case of filling filling to this point we'll leave that set dry scrape it back put the straight edge on it again and then make it straight to the top before we do the finishing coats okay so now we've done most of the building up taking a bit of the form work off uh, we'll put it back on the other side to straighten up the other side just let that stuff set go hard splash coat on the steps. We need that to go nice and hard, a couple of days at least. Uh, this is modified plaster, not sand and cement, so it only takes uh, two or three days to set. Uh, a lot quicker than the normal way. So we'll leave all that rolled up to set and dry and then we'll come back. So back here again today, just a little bit more pre-filling of deep holes. another coat on the top here to straighten it up it's looking a lot better now you can see this one here still got a big bend in it um, but we're not going to be able to take too much of that out but a little bit more at the top here will take the um, angle away from the eye when it's looked at after the garden is planted it shouldn't be too noticeable splash coat on the steps um, this one nice and hard now so we're not far off from doing uh, a little bit of finishing so we're just about ready to do the steps now. We're just starting with a uh, splash coat over the top, trying to match it up. It'll look um, pretty close. Once we've got everything on and it um, and it dries out. So this will cover the irregular walls. Okay, we're pretty much done here now. Steps are done, rendered. It's the final coat. Everything should pretty much match up once it's painted. It'll look like it should be there. 